Okay, so writing the equation of an altitude, first we've got a triangle has three corners, vertices, A negative 3, 8, B ne negative 7, 2, and C 13, negative 3. Find the equation of the altitude through A. Remembering that the altitude is from a vertex on the triangle, perpendicular to the opposite side. Okay, so I drew a, a rough sketch of what that triangle would look like. I didn't even put it on a plane or anything, but my uh, altitude is going to be coming from A perpendicular to BC. And it probably won't hit it at the midpoint. It's not, it may or may not, but it, the only thing I know is that that altitude will be perpendicular to segment BC. Okay. Okay. So when I work out this problem, I kind of work backwards. And if I want the equation of this line, I need a point, which I have, A, and I need that line's gradient. Well, I don't know that line's gradient, but I could figure out the gradient of BC. So the gradient of BC, I can figure that out quite simply. That's just change in Y over change in X. And the change in Y of BC is negative uh, 3 minus 2. Negative 3 minus 2 is the change in Y over the change in X, 13 minus negative 7. Okay. You get negative 5 over 20, which equals equals negative a quarter. So the gradient of BC is negative a quarter. I obviously did not draw this correctly because the negative gradient should be going down. So bad, bad drawing there. Okay. Next step, uh, let's find the, the gradient of the median, or gradient of the altitude, sorry. And I do the perpendicular gradient. Uh, so the perpendicular gradient or, or just the gradient of the altitude is going to be the opposite reciprocal or or negative 1 divided by negative 1 divided by negative 1 quarter, which is pretty easy to figure out. It's just going to be the opposite reciprocal. It's just going to be 4. Okay, so that's the, that's the gradient I use when I write my equation. Final step is equation, and I'm going to use uh, the formula y minus y1 equals m x minus x1, and I'm going to use 4 for my gradient, and for my point, I'm going to use a. So don't forget to use negative 3, 8 for your point, because it's saying through a. Okay, uh, so that's y minus 8 equals 4 times x minus a negative 3 is just plus 3. And now I do my thing where I expand that 4 through, 4x plus 12, and add that 8 to the other side to get y equals 4x plus 20. And that would be the equation of that altitude through A perpendicular to that line BC. Okay?